for fats, break down into glycerol and fatty acids, and then <clears throat> it could then be uh, further broken down into pyruvate, which then fits into this cycle right here, the PCA cycle. <clears throat> okay, are you starting to see a pattern here? This was the pattern that we derived from looking at the diagrams last week. <clears throat> Once you start breaking those uh, carbon compounds down, whether it be fats or carbohydrates, it's always moving towards creating that pyruvate and coenzyme A so that it can go through the PCA cycle and electron transport chain. So we should see a similar thing coming out of proteins, and we do. So the same pattern, broken down into smaller molecules that then are converted to pyruvate and or coenzyme A, go back through the TCA cycle, electron transport chain, The difference here is that um, proteins have nitrogen because nitrogen is part of the amino acid. So you've got an additional 
waste product of ammonia, which is excreted then in the urine. What you should find is when you build this, it actually guides your descriptors here. <clears throat> and just keep in mind that everything works its way back to being converted to pyruvate and coenzyme A so that it can go through the TCA cycle and electron transport chain. The commonality there. <clears throat> what about alcohol? Yes, alcohol. Alcohol is oxidized, starts oxidation in the stomach actually, and then is finished off in the liver. guys in physiology, has everybody had physiology? Anybody making the wrong assumption? No? Okay. All right. down the alcohol because alcohol dehydrogenates. <clears throat> Since there's fewer carbon bonds, though, it's not as high an energy release.
right, energy storage. <clears throat> if you've got X, um, after you feed, I like that space cap, you feed. After you eat, um, you'll have excess nutrients available. So excess glucose. Suck your fever. Stored as fat. Uh, stored. stored as fat. Also known as lipids, also known as triglycerides. I'm just. Can we just fat is okay. Say that it's stored in the liver muscle and the mm -hmm. tissue. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. For this, yeah, adipose. Proteins. Proteins are a little different in this case. Technically, there's no storage in the body. So if you have excess protein, excess amino acids, 